And so, Conservation of Energy tells us that with no external force, the bowling ball will not go further than its starting point. If you're wrong about this, you're only gonna make my trust issues worse. You can always trust science. Oh, uh. oh my beautiful face is unharmed. Yeah! And that's how it's done. Now, let's move on to our next scientific demonstration. Wait a minute. Why are we doing this? Where's David and Gwen? Ah! <laughs> what was that? A person in need. Sounded like he was coming from the counselor's cabin. Let's go. What the hell's going on? Oh, good! You heard my call for help! You mean your girly scream? I mean my call for help! It appears David and Gwen are sick. We have been tasked with keeping them quarantined. Oh, come on, kids. I'm fine. Now, who wants to go identify every type of floor in the woods? Kempe? 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 Oh, I do not feel so good. <laughs> Ugh, oh, Max. Kids, we need you to go get medicine. We're all out. Oh, I can drive into town. Let me get at them keys. No! <laughs> you gotta hurry. We can't keep any food down. Or up. Gross. <laughs> Gwen, we need tissues too. All these reused ones are pointy and painful. If we can't get into town, we could try that questionable laboratory of Campbell's over on Spooky Island. Yeah, that place could have something. What do you think, Gwen? Ah! 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 Zombies! Ugh, these sick dudes are harshing my vibe. Nerf, what's that on your shoulder? Uh, it's obviously my sleeve. Oh, God, they got me! Ah! Holy shit! It's too late for me. I'll hold them off. Tell my story. But not this part. Will nobody stop these people? Uh. In hell, they make you watch them all in a row. You guys have been here before? Yeah, it's a long story. We don't really want to talk about it. Matt screamed like a girl. It was great. <sighs> Whatever. This place doesn't look that spooky. Come on, let's get this over with. Right. Get in, grab the medicine, get out. Sounds simple enough. What could go wrong? There's a secret entrance right up here. Open sesame! Ah! Oops. I think I broke it. God damn it, Nikki. This was supposed to be easy. Now what do we do? Maybe I can fix it. Oh, <laughs> ah! What? I'm trying to help, guys. Kill it! Kill it with fire! Ah! Ah! Wait! Ah! He's gonna eat my brain! Space Kid, no! Leave him! He's the most expendable! Man, this cold is spreading just as fast as your mom's legs on Parents' Day. If not faster. I guess we'll have to find another way in. There could be an entrance out here. Look, doors on the ground. It's a cellar entrance. This could be exactly what we need. Doesn't look like there's a way in from here. You find anything? Nothing but tiny little snacks. I'm really full. Looks like someone was already here. <gasps> and they left their Pog collection. Jackpot! Yeah! Feel the wrath of my Steve Urkel slammer! <laughs> Why did people play this again? Come on, Nikki. This cellar obviously doesn't lead anywhere. Then how'd Neil get in here? Why? Uh... Hi, Neil! I'll trade you this Green Ranger for... Ah! 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 Max, help us. Don't worry, guys. I know exactly what to do. Fuck that! Ow. 
fabulous. This is the kind of house I'll live in after my Hamilton but with jazz musical wins all those Tonys. Who's there? Wait, I need to shield myself from any putrid pathogens. Okay, here we go. I hope no one's pooping. Oh, good. No one's here. Oh, I guess the deodorant fell from the medicine cabinet. Of course, that's where the medicine goes. Finally, Preston will be the hero for once, and they'll make a Lifetime Movie Network biopic about me. The boy who cured the Preston Good Place story. This should do the trick. Everyone will be so grateful. <laughs> ah! Ah, the pills do nothing. No! Man, I need to find some clues that'll help us. Whoa, this looks like it'll help us. Arid! Oh, thank God! Everyone's getting infected! It even got Nikki! That totally blows, dude, but look! These blueprints show another way to get into the lab. There's a laundry chute that leads right to it, for some reason. Holy crap! This is actually really helpful! How'd you find this? Eh, when you're cool, things just kind of work out. Uh. Ah, Preston! Ah, Neil! Uh. Ah, Nikki! Ow, oh, Nikki, what the heck? Uh, sorry, I'm just really in character right now. Uh. Uh. Arid, are, are you okay? Wait, Space Kid, you're not sick? Me? No, I feel pretty good. A little hungry, maybe, but uh, I mean, what can you do? Perfect! <laughs> well, I guess we should be safe here for now. Good thing you there, Bax. Yeah, good job breaking that window. Pick yourself up so we can get to finding that lab. Eric said something about a laundry chute. Oh, that's good. My cape is getting awfully dirty. How are you not sick, Space Kid? Neil had you in his clutches. I don't know either. Ugh, pesky helmet. Space Kid, that's it. Quick, give me your spacesuit. My spacesuit? Why? So that I won't get sick. But then I'll get sick. Yeah, but I won't. Oh, that makes sense. Ah, no! Max! Get to the laboratory! Don't screw this up, you idiot! Oh no. How, how, how do I get out of here? Ah! Oh boy. That's all it to be, but I don't know where to go. Oh, uh, sorry. I can't get no privacy around here. Get out! This is hopeless. My friends are going to be zombies forever. Oh, hey there, space dude. It's not often that I get visitors here on Spooky Island. I wish it didn't do that. Oh, uh, hello. I'm here to save my friends. They're turning into zombies and I need to find a cure. Dang, that's heavy. I need to find a Labrador to cure them. A Labrador? You sure you're not looking for a laboratory? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sure. I can see how you'd get those two confused, though. Right. Well, listen, I know this place like the back of my hand, and since the only guests I usually get are creepy old people trying to get their freak on, I'll try to help you out. Oh, thank goodness! I need all the help I can get. There's a chute that leads to the Labrador. Can you take me there? Man, you have no idea what you're talking about. Come with me. <gasps> uh. Oh, yeah. Let's go this way. Well, here you go, my bromide. This should take you straight down to the lab. But uh, it's a square hole, and I have a round head. That won't work. Take your chrome dome off, you big goof. You'll fit no problemo. But uh, my helmet's the only thing keeping me from getting sick like my friends. Don't wig out on me, man. There aren't any sick people around here. <laughs> oh, boy. OK, look. You're looking for medicine, penicillin, antibiotics, pills. You know what pills look like, right? Well, yeah, but are you sure it's not- It's not a dog! Get out of here! Come with me! We can both escape! 
No can do, amigo. I'm cursed to be confined to this island for the rest of time. Well, that is, until my physical body can find peace in the living realm, anyway. Okay. Wow. I'll never forget you, whatever your name is. <laughs> Science stuff. Are you medicine? Any medicine under here? Oh, none of this stuff is going to help anyone. Haley's Comet. That's it. Right! The conversation of allergies! They can't get me from there! Now there's only one thing left to do. Great work curing us all of our illness, Space Kid. Yeah, to be honest, I thought we were all doomed when it was just you left. But somehow you managed to pull it off. And, as your reward, you won't be cleaning up the bathrooms after what the rest of us did to them. I said I was sorry. Three cheers for Space Kid! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Aw, oh, thanks everyone. I guess it's just been up so smart at science and finding medicine, huh? Uh oh, I don't feel so good. Oh no, Space Kid's sick now, and we're all out of medicine. What do we do? I mean, he is wearing a suit. He can't get us sick. 